Welcome to the School of Silence. This is where the noisiest children in the country are sent for some intensive silent training. Very shortly, we're going to be following four new arrivals. And have they got what it takes to stay completely silent? Follow me. Shh. This rowdy lot are from North London and are having their noise levels assessed by the headmistress and the form tutor. You, first child, what's your name? <laughs> Alyssa has no verbal self-control and apparently her sister is sick of her being so noisy. You, what's your name? Gabby! Gabby is a real giggler and would love to scream her head off in a library. Third child, what's your name? <laughs> Chadas is a noisy joker and is constantly being told off at school for being loud and cheeky. Last child, what's your name? Mohan! Mohan loves to play his saxophone really loudly and he will laugh at practically anything. This lot have certainly been sent to the right place. They're going to need a lot of work. That's enough! Get out! <laughs> Here's how the day works. The new pupils have three challenging classes to learn how to be silent, followed by the crucial final exam, which will determine whether they graduate or will be expelled. If they are too noisy... <laughs> I will know about it, thanks to this device, the Gobstop 2000, the latest in noise monitoring technology. If they pass, they will graduate and receive the ultimate reward, the golden gobstopper. If they fail to keep that shut, then I will have no choice but to expel them. Now, before we begin, I must ensure the school has been hushed down. Seven seconds to hush down. Seven, six, four, three, two, It's time for their style of training to start. It's their first class of the day with Mr Gross. Shh. Who's humming? Was it you? You'll come to grief. Oh, it's you lot. Come in, sit down. Quietly, please. What are those shoes? Trainers? Who said anything about trainers? Right. Who said anything about 1978 sandals? <laughs> yeah. Insolence. You'll come to grief. You'll be for the high jump. Right. I am Mr Gross, your teacher for general studies. <laughs> the first lesson of your silent training. Remember, Miss Gobstop is listening to those microphones. You see this girl? Put the desk down. Hello. That? Yes, she's listening. Every time you're too noisy, she will hear it. Right, time for silent training to begin. Shh. Say what? What? No, <laughs> it's not an instruction. <laughs> During this task, the chosen teammate will have to hold up a series of speech bubbles. You will have 30 seconds to reveal the speech bubbles to the chosen teammate, during which you must remain absolutely silent. Gabby, you will pick a gobstopper to find out who you're doing the challenge to. Let's see. Green! Wonderful! Mahan. Thing, and it's all part of your silent training. Your 30 seconds starts now. So, will they stay silent? Oh, a little noise there. <laughs> a, a definite giggle from Mahan. <laughs> oh, more giggling. Keep it in, you're doing well. Just a few more seconds. <laughs> oh, another giggle. Hold it. Enough time up. That was terrible. Look at you. Sniggering, insolent behaviour the whole way through. Sit down, please. Quickly. Quickly. Mahan, sit down. Not in that chair. In your proper chair. Oh, good grief. Shh. Let's see if they do any better with this one. Sand. Back. You, Elisa, will have 
30 seconds to pour wet, soggy sand down the back of the chosen teammate. And this must be done in absolute silence. Right, let's find out who you're doing it to. Pick out a gobstopper. No peeking. Oh, Chadass. What a shame. You will have 30 seconds to put that lovely sand down Naughty Chadass's back. Are you ready? Yes. Your 30 seconds starts now. Oh, some noise there. I'm talking. More noise, this is not good. <laughs> That's better. Hold it. Yeah. Nearly there. Time enough! Stop! I said enough! Sit down, Elisa, quickly! <sighs> Chadis, look Hello. at the mess you've made. Sit down, child. Are you sure that's sand? It looks disgusting. Right. <laughs> that was absolutely dreadful. This will bode extremely badly for your report. Oh, dear. What's next? It's called flying toilet paper. <laughs> Mahan, you will have 30 seconds to throw the wet toilet paper at the chosen teammate who will be wearing a target, which you must try and hit. But who will you be doing it to? Pick a gobstopper. Which colour will it be? Red! Elisa! Good! I think you deserve some of this, don't you? The lovely toilet paper. It's not in used toilet water. There's no we in it. I tasted it myself. Right, here's the bowl. When I give you the signal, you will have 30 seconds to empty that bowl on that target as quickly as you can, and it must be done in absolute silence. You will have to be silent, 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 and so will all of you. Your 30 seconds starts now. Oh, oh that is loud. Oh. Oh. More noise. Oh, oh no. <laughs> Giggling from Mahan. <laughs> More giggling. <laughs> A few more seconds. Stop! Time is up! Enough, Mahan! Oh, good grief! Look at the mess you've made of my lovely classroom! Yeah. It's disgraceful! Sit down immediately! Elisa, sit down! You silly girl. <laughs> I need to lie down. Old age. <laughs> Shush! You'll come to grief. <laughs> if you want to win the golden gobstopper in your final exam, it doesn't bode very well. Not very well at all. Plus, you've made a dreadful mess of my classroom. Look at this. You don't seem to have grasped the rules. This is the school of silence, which means you'll be silent, not noisy, giggling, laughing and being insolent. You're dismissed. Get out of my class! Quickly! Quickly! Noisy, giggly, rude. Did I mention noisy? And that Gabby, such a giggler. I'll be keeping my ear on her. Right, come on then. What happened? The first one was say what? Yeah? How did, how did that go? Um, Not good. It challenged it laughing and he wasn't even doing the challenge. OK, and the second test was? Sandback. Sandback. And how did that feel, Kadesh? Not great for me. If I get to pick you in that next round, we'll oh, see about that. Don't forget to teamwork, you've got to stay silent though. How about flying toilet paper? How did that go? Were you quiet? Well, did you manage? A little kept going <coughs> at the beginning, but then they got quiet. That's why it's so hard to stay silent. How are you feeling so far though? Because bear in mind, these tests are all part of your silent training. Do you think they're working? Uh, no. <laughs> uh, no. Okay, well, next is going to be in the canteen. Are you ready? Right. Yeah. yeah. Good luck. <laughs> Attention, attention. This is the school of silence. 
All pupils attending recorder practice are reminded not to bring their recorders. They make far too much noise. With one class down, it's time for some more silent training. Shh! Cooey! It's lunchtime! Welcome to my kitchen. My name is Mrs Nora Nugget, and this is my lovely assistant, Brittany Biscuit. Well, you have been sent to me today as part of your silent training, but I've heard reports from Mr Grouse that you were very, very noisy in his class. Just remember that uh, Miss Gobstop is listening to every single word you say. Let's see what's first up on the menu. Cake. Face. Now, you will have 30 seconds in which to throw quite a lot of cream cakes into the face of your chosen teammate. Gabriella, dear, if you would like to choose a gobstopper from our jar there, we'll find out. Ooh, Elisa. Right then, Gabriella, if you wouldn't mind, dear, just come round into the kitchen. Soft. Thank you. Gabriella the giggler. Well, I want you to try and remain as silent as you can when you throw these cakes at your friend Alyssa. All right? Do you think you could do that for me? Yes? You have got to get every single one of these cakes. You have th 30 seconds of silence beginning now. <laughs> oh, a giggle. <laughs> More laughing. More noise. Oh, dear. <laughs> Ten seconds on the clock. Who's nice? Oh, talking now. Oh, no. Oh! That's time. You got, you got oh. through quite a lot of cakes, didn't you? But you were giggling. <laughs> Giggle up now. Sorry. Will they stomach this one? Crispy. Crickets. You are going to love this one. <laughs> right, your chosen teammate will have to eat all the crickets they can in 30 seconds. I hope you're hungry. Do you like cricket? No. I have them for breakfast every morning. <laughs> right then, let's find out who's going to be taking this. Uh, could I ask you to do the gobstoppers there, please, Brittany? There we go. Pick one out of there and we'll... Find out who it's going to be. <laughs> oh, man! Well, wonderful! You've been looking forward to that, haven't you? Absolutely. Woo! Oh, there we go. Just pop them down in front of my hand there. Right, there we go. OK. 30 seconds of absolute silence, all of you. And you must eat as many of those as you can, all right? I want to see that, that jar empty. You have 30 seconds, starting from now. <laughs> oh, well, that's not a good start. Loads of giggling. I can't get them out. And talking too. <laughs> ah, more noise there. Wait, well, it's got to be one. More talking from Gabby there. <laughs> Just a few seconds left. Come on. Come on. Uh, well, I don't blame him. Who'd eat an insect anyway? <gasps> she didn't. <laughs> okay, what's next? Chocolate salon. Okay, you will have 30 seconds in which to style your chosen teammate's hair with, uh, with chocolate sauce and, uh, and a selection of rather fine accessories that Brittany has lent us from her own collection. <laughs> well, right, then let's find out who's going to be playing. Can you bring the coloured gobstoppers in, please? Who's it going to be? Who is it, Brittany? Who is it? Oh, oh, oh yes! Lovely, man. <laughs> Can we have the shampoo and the accessories? There we go. So, Chadis, if you could stand behind my hand. And jump out of your stool and stand behind him, if you wouldn't mind. You have 30 seconds of silence. All right, starting from now. Oh, a lot of noise there. More noise. So, on go the curlers. Oh. 
groaning from the hall. Oh, dear. Oh, that's time! Well, you did pretty well, but uh, we'll have to see how you do in your final examination this afternoon with Colonel Kittens. Shh. If you don't improve in your silent training, you shan't pass your final examination this afternoon, and you won't win the Golden Gobstopper now, will you? OK. Well, off you go, then. It's lovely to meet you all. Lunch is over, and look who's joining Gabby in the Giggle Brigade. Marham. And he didn't even eat his crickets. <laughs> OK, uh, let's talk about the first one. Cake face. You put cake on you. What happened? Gabby <laughs> threw cake on me. I thought you were my friend. <laughs> oh, yeah. Um, chocolate salon. Talk me through your, um, your style. What were you going for? What sort of look? It's improved. You think it's an improvement on the original? OK, well, listen, you've got your last lesson. So what's to say that you're completely silent? We won't be. <laughs> How do you know? Have you met Miss Bunsen? We have him. Oh, I see. Kadash, <laughs> he's a troublemaker, is he? He's the one making all the noise. Let's see what happens. Good luck, guys. Attention, attention. This is the school of silence. Pupils are reminded to tuck their shirts in and do it quietly. They have just one class to go before their final exam. They've arrived. Come in. Sit down. That's right, Mahan. That's it. Now, I am Miss Bunsen and I am your science teacher. This is your last class before your final exam. So it's very, very important that you follow the rules. Remember, science in silence. Got it? Got it? Good. <laughs> now then, you will be my little guinea pigs. Will they keep quiet in this one? Non drop gloves. I have invented a very special pair of gloves which should make sure you catch anything, anything at all. Now, let's see which one of you will be testing it. <laughs> Here you go, Ellie. Pick to see who will be testing it for me. Unlucky. <laughs> right. Shh. You have got to throw those at Ellie, OK? And you're going to catch them. Don't worry, because, of course, they're non drop gloves. <laughs> now, then, are you ready? Really? Well done. Let's see mm. if it works. You have 30 seconds in absolute silence, my little guinea pigs. Starting from... No! Oh. oh, a bit of noise there. <laughs> oh, you've got to keep those giggles in. <laughs> Some talking and laughing. <laughs> More chuckles from Mahan. Time's up! Are you... There's far too much giggling. Oh, dear. The gloves worked well, though, didn't they? Eh? <laughs> oh, shame about you. Now, come on, then. Take those off. One more, and then the final exam. Fizzy, silent, disco. Now, one of you will be dancing like a hip-hop dude, but you'll be also holding some bottles of fizzy pop. Now, the idea is to transfer all that dance energy into fizz power. Now, let's see. Chadas, you pick. Ooh, which one of you is going to be the doing the dancing? Oh, <laughs> oh unlucky. Twice. <laughs> oh, Ellie, it's you. Shh. Put these on you. Bottles of fizzy pop. Of course, you'll need your medallion. <laughs> Let's have a look at you. Oh, 50 pence. Great. <laughs> Great. You have 30 seconds and your time starts. No! Now, remember, we can't hear any music, but Alyssa is having it blasted through those earphones. Keep those giggles in. Ah, this is much better. Mm. 
Now that is some good silent dancing. Nearly there. Time is up! Right, quickly. Open up. See how I've got... Oh! 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 <laughs> look at her. Oh, look at that fizz energy! Talk about your performance. Ellie, star pupil of the day. Everything in absolute silence. Fantastic. OK, I think you're ready for your final exam. Possibly. May the force be with you, my little Ewok. Mahan and Gabby, no improvement. Kel surprise. Alyssa and Chadas, very good. I like the silent disco. It's my kind of music. How do you think you're doing with your silent training? I think we've got it's better a lot. It's the final exam. Can you be silent? Yeah. Mm, maybe. For me, no, but for the rest, yeah. Well, we'll see. They've had their three classes, and now it's time for their final exam. Colonel Kittens will really put them to the test. To graduate and win the golden gobstopper, they must keep that shut. If they set off the gobstop 2003 times, they will be expelled! Their silent training has all been building up to this, their final exam, with Colonel Kittens. Right! My name is Colonel Kittens. <laughs> and it is my job to make you crack. <laughs> Sniggering, are we? Highly amusing, I'm sure you'll find it. You won't for very long. This is your final exam. Now. Are you ready to suffer in silence? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Kinda. No, <laughs> silence! <laughs> I will throw everything at you. But remember, make three noises that set off the Gobstop 2000, and it will go on your final report, and you will fail. Uh -oh. Keep silent, and you will pass. Whoopee for do. Your time starts now! What will it be? Ah, oh, it's the feather duster. Oh, me. What a squeal there already. Gabby keeping the giggles in. What a great start. Oh, thumbs up. Oh, it's the cold, lumpy oh. custard. Oh, a big noise from Mahan. <laughs> oh, no, he's going for Mahan. He knows he's the weak one. Come on, hold it, hold it. Oh, no, the gun's booped. That hit somewhere bad. You can't talk. Oh, no, the slimy socks. Not holding back today. <laughs> you can tell he's a professional. <laughs> There's more giggling. <laughs> and this is trying to keep control of them, but Colonel Kittens is going for it here. <laughs> he's gone for the fun feathers now. Come on, guys, hold it. <laughs> Five seconds left. Who's going to get it? I knew he would. That's got to be a strike. Oh. Time is up! And look at the terrible mess you've made in my gym! I think you made an awful lot of noise during that, don't you? You're just jealous. Jealous? Yeah. How can I be jealous? Look at the state of you. You look like a gooey peacock. Disgraceful. Yeah. Are you wondering how you did? No. Well, what are you waiting for? Go and find out! Yeah. <laughs> That was the final exam. How do you think you did? Rubbish. Really? No, I think we did OK. Let's talk about Miss Gobstop, though, because, of course, she is either going to graduate you or expel you. What do you think is going to happen? You're going to get kicked out. You're going to get kicked out? I think we might graduate. I'm not sure. <laughs> You're going to go see Miss Gobstop. What's going to happen? Expelled. Expelled? Graduation. Graduation? Expelled. I don't know. Well, come on, let's go and see Miss. Uh, I'll lead the way, because I'm, of course, the best dancer. You ready? <laughs> <laughs> come on. <laughs> 
Now it's time to find out how they did in their final exam. Come in. Quickly. Now you were all sent here because you're all far too noisy. And we've put you through rigorous training. And let's see what the report says, shall we? With Mr. Gross. Tell us. You were outrageous. Not only noisy. Rude, but cheeky. <laughs> With Nora Nugget, you got a lot better. But Gabby, your incessant giggling, brought me out in a rush. Shh, shh. <laughs> in the science lab, we had some promising development. And then your final exam. Now, will you graduate or will you be expelled? I can now reveal that you will be expelled. One of you set off the gobstop 2000 three times. Not once, not twice, three times. Mom, it was you. Let's see the three strikes. That's one. There's two. And three. It nearly exploded. Not funny. I won't be giving you the wonderful golden gobstopper. You'll receive this. Take it. Terribly noisy, giggly, and cheeky. Get out. Out! Out! You too, Barney. Out! Coming up is MI High, the tough job for those that sent hopes as they tried to save the world's last Neanderthal from being used by the evil Usmanis. If you love the new adventure starring Sarah Jane Smith and the Doctor, then celebrate with CBBC. Text SJA to 84400 and get a free CBBC mobile wallpaper. You can even download a special wallpaper for your computer from the CBBC website. Just click on the Sarah Jane Adventures, go to the attic and find Sarah Jane's PC. Downloads are free, but do make sure your phone can get MMS messages and remember to ask permission first. You can find full terms and conditions on the Sarah Jane website, but there's a limited number, so be super quick. In this evening of an unidentified creature. Go that way. What happened? It's the ring, And it's inside one of them. Use the sonic lipstick to mess with this compressor. There's something about that postman. No, it's the girl. It's got to be the granny. Her skin does not fit properly. <laughs> Didn't you see the pickled onions in her basket? Vinegar's fatal to Blatherine. They'd never get that close to it. <laughs> the new series of the Sarah Jane Adventures. Thursdays and Fridays at 4.35. CBBC on BBC One. Thank you.